Welcome to What the Fuck is in the Box. I'm hey. here joined again by the one and only Mike Barsha. Bam! I'm here for you. I have come here to chew bubblegum and kick ass. And I'm all out of bubblegum. Just for you. That's the only reason Just you're here. Just for you. He's it. very upset I took him off the phones for this. So this, this has yeah. got to be good. It's got to be good. What'd you bring? So today we brought our mini Alpine amplifier, the KTA 450. Um, this is a very small amplifier. Mm. It's designed to be hidden behind a dash, behind a panel. Um, has a lot of options for accessibility to, for install. Nice. Usually on the amps, uh, box is pretty simple. Kind of the case here, right? Key features for you guys, the amp boxes are really more for the shop than it is for the customer. The customer is going to need the amp based on your recommendation. So what I really like is they cater the box to that. They go over the overall statistics of the amplifier really on the box, have a really good image of it, showing kind of the mounting years and a little bit of the size. But other than that, very clean, very simple box for you guys in the retail showrooms. Let's get inside. We have Vincent. Yes, that's the fun Squirt. part. All the fun. I ends. actually think the box looks great, though. It does. It's very clean. It's very nice. I actually didn't test to see if this was taped, and I'm so happy that it wasn't. Uh, here you go. You can go through that thing. What's All that right. Thing? This is our owner's manual. It's not. Look, there's a thank you on it. Go back. Go back. Don't just assume. That's thank a thank you. you. Choosing Alpine. Thank Those are nice thank touches, you. man. That is a nice you know, touch. they really appreciate us, and just I just like we should do with all of our customers. Always thank them. Get with the marketing team. We need thank yous. I agree. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, thank you. Get I'm the great. thank yous out there. We need thank yous. All right. Well, this is nice. It's a magical this is way box. smaller than I thought it was gonna be. Yeah. Am I crazy? Or is your hand really small? About the size of a KFC spork. And for, that's a good thing in this case. <laughs> a very good thing in this case. Let's see what we got. We gotta untape it. See? I didn't look for tape. Didn't. I didn't check for tape. This is my fault. We'll get through it. Don't worry. Here you go. So, I kind of already mentioned, right? So, what makes this product really unique is the size of the amplifier. Alpine was the very first ones to come out with these mini amplifiers that are designed to be, you know, hidden behind the dash, behind the radio. You put an aftermarket radio in. Um, they have a, a harness that plugs right into the radio, and um, this fits behind the dash. You can zip tie it. You can um, find a great mounting bracket to, and a great place to mount it. But what makes this specific amplifier unique is what Drew's doing right now, is this bracket. Oh, you're just gonna pop the, the yeah. I, I like the bubbles. <laughs> yeah. So this right here is unique to anyone else. So Alpine has an amplifier that we talked about in a previous video. Alpine has an amplifier. Alpine has an amplifier. Alpine has an amplifier. A radio. Radio called an ILXW650, and it's specifically designed to work with this amplifier. So what you'll do is you mount the amplifier to the back of the radio like so, with your mounting bracket right there, and now everything. I'll van away for you. Oh, fantastic! I don't so know what I'm doing. You slide it in there, but it's okay. It's okay. Here. But you get the point. You work on that. I'll work on this. Okay, fantastic. We'll figure the it point out. is that now you have a doubled-in radio, CarPlay, Android Auto. And you have an amplifier that will, you know, whether you're running factory speakers or whether you've upgraded the speakers with some nice Alpine, you know, Type R's, Type S's, maybe go to the X series speakers. Now you're amplifying those. Um, so now you're getting technology and be able to, you know, uh, upgrade in the car in that respect. But now you're getting better sound at the same like time. Like a round of applause. I figured it out. Yes. This is how it goes. And then it touches to the back like so. Yes. There's exactly. even screws. Figured it out. Even I can so, figure this out. And with the, with the depth, once you've had the amplifier, you're at the regular, traditional, doubled in depth. Yep. But you're not getting performance, right? You're, you're getting performance, real performance with a real amplifier behind it now. What I really like is that they give you just a little bit of space, right, to get the cables you need to get still with the back of the radio. So it doesn't mount directly to the back. This bracket keeps it about what looks to be about three quarters of an inch off the radio. 
which is going to allow you to get your USB cable off the radio, your pre-outs, all that stuff, your harnesses. Uh, So you won't have to bend those cables. This is a really well thought through bracket. Let's put that guy back. So this specific radio is going to be 50 watts by four. This specific radio, radio, radio. So now you'll be able to run your front and rear channel, this amplifier. 50 watts by four. See, this is why we don't do two products at once. Right, Right, exactly. You're going to have your front and right, front and rear, right and left. Um, Now you can run this also in a two channel mode or a three channel mode. So you do have a couple options on selectivity. Sam Sloan. Sir. Somebody said you stole some secrets. Say what? Oh. (laughs) Stop spouting off. September 7th, the 76th slick. Someone said you think it's something psychedelic. Same talk. Mm -hmm. You also have some frequency control, which is different on this amplifier than some of the other amplifiers that you do mount behind the dash. So um, some of the benefits are now you can have a better option for tuning the amplifier. All right. (laughs) What are these for? talk. That's okay. At least there's not 75,000 people watching us. They go on the side of the amplifier Wait. when you install it. Oh, okay. What do they do? Nothing. I got no idea. Uh, you're clever. There it is. Yeah. This guy knows his stuff over here. Every once in a while. Every once in a while. What's this guy here? So that's your harness. So Harness all the power. So this will plug into the back of the radio so you get your input out of the head unit into the amplifier. Hey! <laughs> got it right the there you go. <laughs> then, um, this is your power harness. So this will go to your aftermarket or factory speakers, and this is your power ground. And of course, you got your remote wire that goes out of the head unit and connect to the amplifier. Cool. So, so a really nice piece, really clean piece. This is a great add-on sale. That's the reason I think it's important for the retailers out there. Uh, if you're gonna sell a radio, especially the necklace radio that we mentioned uh, prior, this piece goes really well with it. It does come with a bracket design to mount right to the back of it. Super clean install in your cars. Everything is back behind the radio. Everything's a clean look. Even comes with, you know, your, everything you're gonna use. You got your screws, you got your zip ties, you got your wire harness, you got your amplifier, you got a thank you note. Just cause you know, everybody deserves a thank you. Absolutely. Everybody deserves thank you. I mean, nobody's done this before until now. So, I mean, I think it's really awesome. That's a great piece. So again, big, big thank you to the guys over at Alpine. Uh, we are raffling this off, as always, so please put your comments with your dealer name, dealer number. Uh, we'd love to get support. We love subscribers, so thank you guys for subscribing. Hopefully we get a couple more because, you know, this guy over here is pretty popular, way more popular than me. Not at all. He this is, is the guy. Mm-hmm. Thank you guys for joining. Uh, we'll see you next time. Thank you very much. Thank you guys. See ya. Sergeant, somebody said some seriously sickening stuff. Says Sam Sloan should stop snooping and sleuthing or some snapper will soon snub slippery Sam. So silent and no scream and sounds will save him. Son the snipper stabber. Sorry, I got some sugary strawberry doodle on that. Snipper snatcher the snip sweeper sent that. Sorry, Sergeant, I'm silent.